Welcome back to another video. On today's video, I am going to be transforming myself into Hello Kitty. I don't want to waste any time, so let's go ahead and hop right into it. These are the brushes I'm going to be using for my eye makeup. These are the new Sanrio brushes that I got from Ulta. Super cute and perfect for Christmas. Now, let's go ahead and do a little bit of bake. So I added some shimmer to my powder just to give me a nice glow. And I'm just pressing that in. I'm gonna do this before I start my eye makeup because if I have any fallout, I can just brush it away at the end. So now I'm going in with this NYX white liner and I wipe a little bit of it off. And then I slowly just start to kind of make a little line right above my top of my lid. And then I'm gonna make one triangle that doesn't have the bottom <laughs> and then another triangle that doesn't have the bottom kind of just like that do you see the little kitty ears i do can you see it <laughs> we are then going to repeat the exact same thing on the other side we're going to start with the line across i get to kind of where the arch would be in my eyebrow then make the little triangle a little line a little triangle and a little line I think it looks pretty good, not perfect, but good. Now I'm taking a little red eyeliner pencil and I'm making triangle again, and they're gonna be connecting to each other with a little circle right in the middle. Do you guys see that? Side triangle, side triangle, circle in the middle, and then I'm just gonna darken it up to make it look like a bow. Now I'm going in with this Mean Girls palette and I'm going in with the prettiest pink ever and putting it on my waterline. Then I'm going in with the purple and putting it all over my lid. And then I'm adding just a little shimmer to the lid as well. And then you see me doing the triangle again on the other eye. So triangle sideways, triangle sideways, and then the little bow in the middle, and then lightly cover everything with the red pencil, you know, whatever was outlined. <laughs> So once we got that, we're going to go ahead and go in with that pink shade again and this liner brush from the Hello Kitty kit. And we're just going to like really make the white part pop by adding that pop of pink right on the bottom of it. And then we're going to connect a little wing from the edges all the way to the bottom of the waterline since it is the same color and I think it looks really cool. Now we have to add lashes and blush i love blush and i feel like this look causes for a lot of blush so we're just going to do the whole like sunburnt look and how we do that is we just get the bridges of our nose and all of our cheeks just like a big thing across our face mid face i guess now we're doing highlighter tip of the nose bridge of the nose and inner corners i'm adding some gloss this is lip color changing gloss it's so hydrating. Now we are taking off the rest of the bake and we are just blending everything in. We're doing one of my favorite tricks, which is a upside down V under each eye just to give me a more anime type look since I am a cartoon character right now. Adding some bottom and top layer mascara and then we're gonna go ahead and spray our hair with some deep conditioner leave-in spray. I'm brushing everything through with a wet brush in preparation for the hairstyle. So I'm gonna separate my hair in half and go ahead and put a ponytail on each side and I am gonna braid it. So I'm gonna take my hair into a sections of three and then crisscross them over. So one over the other. That's kind of the gist of French braiding. You guys can see it here. And then I'm gonna tie it at the very bottom with another little rubber band. And I'm gonna do the same on both sides so you look like this. I'm also adding a little bit more of a red lip tint just to give my face a little bit more color. But I look like Pippi Long stocking. This is what the back looks like. And we are gonna put it up. So we are twisting it around and then I'm adding three bobby pins one on the top one on the side and then one on the other side to make sure it's really secure doing the same one from this side we're repeating bobby pin bobby pin and bobby pin and we're doing this because we're actually going to be wearing a wig so this is how i install the wig this is my wig cap you need a wig cap like there's no exceptions this is why i do the braids the way that i do because if i did the braids from the top it would be too bulky on the top which we don't want i want it to lay flat on the top and be secure in the back so then i brush out my wig it does have little clasps that you can adjust based off your head size but i have them pre-adjusted and then you really want to pull in and like make sure that cap with all the hair 
is in there and then it's secure and then you can like scoot it up and do whatever you'd like with it see so cute i also figured i would add a little bit of pedazzle to my fingernails i'm adding these little hello kitty from la cream shop stickers on my fingernails just to give me that little added touch another look at the eye makeup guys i'm obsessed i think it came out so good we are going to go ahead and show you now the look my shirt is from Forever 21. The stockings and the leg warmers are from Hot Topic. The necklace from Hot Topic. The purse from Hot Topic. The glasses I made myself. The headband is from Hello Kitty Cafe. I love it. This is another look me at the park. Just showing you guys everything. And um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching me turn myself into Hello Kitty. This was definitely a really fun look. I love it. I love everything about it. Oh, and the skirt is from Spencer's, by the way. I didn't mention that. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. I don't know if I like this one or the creamy one better. Comment down below if you guys saw that one. Tell me what you think. If you made it all the way to the end of today's video, comment down below a little pink bow in honor of Hello Kitty herself. That way I know you guys made it all the way through with me. On that note, I love you guys and I'll see you on my next one. Bye!